Let's stick in there. Hello, Stream Deck users. So, once again, to help protect people's privacy and stuff, I've blanked out the actual posts and faces and whatnot, and I've copied the relevant post into, into Notepad. Well, we've got somebody here uh, looking to help his sons out at Christmas. They boys are going to be well chuffed once they get this thing set up. Now, I don't play League of Legends, so this video is more a, a general how-to, uh, how you might go about sort of achieving this. So, I've set up my favourite game because I have quite a lot of controls set up for this. Oh, don't run that up. Welcome to my digital den, by the way. I'm your hostess. I'm Debbie. Pleased to meet you all. So you don't get. A, I really need to get a better camera for this. I really do. Anybody got a spare two hundred pound <laughs> or more? that's for a camera, I would then need a decent stand. Anyway, but I'm digressing. So what I've got here is, you don't actually see it too well, but if I push that button, it changes. So this is various profiles I have set up for various games. If I then push that button, that gives me controls relevant to this game. Now, as you may have seen before I've pulled the camera down, I've got quite a few toys. But we'll come back to that, that doesn't matter at this point. So if I switch to drive, so looking to set up in-game controls and macros. Now I've got Two different setups going here and I'll demonstrate them then go over how they're set up. So if I do hang on a minute. Get the camera up. No, stop moving. Oh, yeah, the fats. This is. Oh, come on. He's the front of the truck. I need to start the truck up. Right. So, I don't know how well this will show up on camera. But if I push that button, see how it's sort of more of white colour. The truck lights are off. I can then switch the truck lights on. And it's a bit more green. So that's a macro for what's called a multi-action. If I use the standard keyboard, do L, you get side lights. Do L again, you get headlights. L again to switch off. That's too much messing about. If I push this button again, the lights go off. That, that is what is called a multi-action switch. One side of the switch, if you pay attention, side lights, headlights. The second side of the switch then turns everything off. You can see the left hand mirror on the screen there. If you come over, if I push that button, that's a simple multi action. Switches the mirrors off. And that one is a single hotkey to switch the mirror back on. So when I'm looking at junctions or trying to find out if it's clear or not, if that mirror's in the road, I push that button. 
mirror has gone. What's that button? So how does that all work? Uh, I can get to the, the menu screen, press escape. So how does that all work? Well, it's quite simple. Uh, if you know the in-game controls, you just program the Stream Deck, and I'll show you how momentarily. So let's see. So there we have light modes. I've also got the same functionality over on the Stream Deck. Oh, I can maybe put this back up out the road. Right. So I'll now show you how that's all done. I need to come out the game. Uh, please. And if I then bring the stream deck up into view. I've got three stream decks as you've just seen. I'm using deck three to control the game. So if I push the one with the Joy Pad logo, Euro Truck. So there's the controls I was using. So if you know the, the keyboard command, we are using hotkey. The main two categories you'll be using as system and stream deck and that doesn't want to expand right there we go so as you can see there i'm using system hotkey that's then just dragging that into a place where you want it you can either click the key or you can pull down from a menu. The truck the truck driving game I was just demonstrating, it doesn't really allow for um, F13 to 24. Some games do, so you would select that. The, the truck driving game doesn't allow for combinations like shift a control a all a stuff like that so but yeah if you wanted to change that you can do say shift a obviously changing the text as you go the hotkey switch for the lights that's a multi action switch for the mirrors that is simply a multi-action. So let's have a look at this. Here's the multi-action switch. You've got the left side of the switch, or the off side. Then you've got the right hand side of the switch, is the on side. So when the vehicle's first powered up, the lights are off. So what I'm saying, push this side, run these two actions, press L once for side lights, L2 for headlights, then that side of the switch becomes that side, that's then a single action, so when I push that same button, the switch presses the L button again, goes back to the left. Multi-action doesn't have a left or a right. It's only an on and an off. 
Så vi kan sige, som, hvad er der død af af? Men pludselig sige, ki twice, en de f ki har vi en ærlig demonstration af den, for at se, hvad vi kan døde med på keys. Can can I have this done? Uh, I've got this set up as folders. Most of these are folders, but you can't really jump from one folder. I mean, if I wanted to go straight from, say, this folder straight to another folder, like uh, if I wanted to go straight to control my lights, I can't do that. From here, I would need to set up a profile. So you can set up profiles. Uh, a good way to demonstrate that is actually I've got the, the audio control set up. Close that. So then I've got my audio controls. Page one. Can't jump to directly to profile two because I'm out of buttons. But if I go into two, I can jump straight to one. So that's the essentials. I hope that helps. I'll put the links to download the software in the description below. I do have other videos uh, here on YouTube. Uh, feel free to check those out. Those might help. Uh, I think that kind of covers it. Another one that might be really useful just before I go is a super macro. That is also really useful. Downloading plugins. Again, that's been mentioned in other videos. I'll quickly go over it again. Just click on this icon up the top. Plugins. And start typing for what you want. If, if, it, if you start typing, and you don't get a match, then chances are there's no plugins. They're not available for the native Stream Deck app anyway. I was thinking Microsoft Office here, but nothing. I think that's uh, me for now. Hope that helps. Bye for now.